Hi, this is Michelle at AppWorks, and today I'm going to show you how to write a calculation using one of FileMaker's most useful and commonly used functions called a case. A case statement is used to run a series of tests returning a different result for each one, depending on whether or not that test returns true or false. A perfect example of this is setting a priority based off of a due date. If the due date is today, for instance, you might make the priority critical. If it's due tomorrow, that priority level would be high. To demonstrate this, let's use our data viewer to write a calculation. We'll start a new expression and we'll begin by using the function called case. I'm gonna add in a few extra lines here just to make this more legible but it's not necessary. The first parameter that the case function requires is the test itself. We're going to check this task due date and see, is it today? The next parameter will be the result if this test returns true. We're gonna make this critical. We could stop here and simply offer in a result if this returns false, or we could continue with a series of tests. Next, we'll check to see if the task due date is due any time within the next three days. We'll say if the task due date is greater than today and less than or equal to the get current date plus an extra three days. And if this is true, then we're going to return a result of high priority. Next, we're going to check to see if the task due date is due any time in the next week. And for that, we will check, oh, make sure we choose the right one. The task due date is greater than the current date and less than or equal to the current date plus an extra seven days. If that is true, we're going to return a result of medium priority. And last but not least, as a backup, when all else fails and everything returns false, we will return the result of low priority. And we'll close out our function with a parenthesis. As of this recording, today being February 22nd, this due date being tomorrow, we're returning a result of high priority. As you can see, all is working well. One important thing to note is that the order in which you write these is very important. FileMaker will process these tests sequentially and will return the first true result that it finds. Meaning, if this line had been written first, then this would have been the first true statement and we would have gotten the result of medium even though the result we really were looking for was high. So just make sure when you're writing your calculations that you account for this workflow and write them accordingly. Thanks for watching.